So one of the things we're gonna do is we're gonna try and take that out. If you can see in the light, it's actually a blinds that has been damaged over time. I'm gonna take that out first, and when we come back on the next cut, that should be taken down and should be on installation. Or maybe we'll show you how to take it. Okay, here we go. Here we go. There's a line in the middle. I'm gonna help you. Just opens it up. And the instruction. We pretty know how to do that. Just do this. Just do this. Just do this. Just do this. Uh, should be fairly simple. And if it's your first time doing it, don't worry. The only thing that you'll screw up is the walls, which hopefully you can repatch again later. But this is. Not happening. So it wasn't really that easy. Not really. Okay, buddy, go. You help me. You help me. Go ahead. Huh. There you go. Okay, now, if you are so lucky as me, and you have a little guy around as a helper, this is probably you might want a pocket for the time being. Because our little screws, you either may want to play with it or he's going to lose it. So, pocket this for the meantime. And sharp objects like this, watch out, watch out, watch out. Okay, hold on one second. Excuse me. This is the rod, extendable. That's right. Oh, there's a tape in there. So we have to take out the tape, I guess the wrapping. We'll take out the wrapping. Whoa, Mr. 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 Okay, you screw it there. You put it in there. Not yet. We have to. It's okay. It's okay. I can show you. You show me. You show me how it's done. Screws in there. And screws. Oh, not yet, not yet, not yet, because this is plastic and it has to be tightened. Turn, turn. Yeah, turn later, turn later, hold on. Okay. We're probably going to fast forward this one for you. Let me uh, pause the camera and then when I come back to you, it should be unwrapped. Alright guys, so we just decided to uh, put the hook right at the edge of the frame just to minimize the leveling process and uh, we leveled the uh, the windows anyways the frame should be leveled and if not then uh, we have issues okay so I'm just gonna put a marker over there just to know where to drill there's drywall I'm hoping to hit wood if not we'll use plastic anchors on it All right, guys, here we go. Here's the drilling. Oh, there's wood, which is a good sign. All right, cool. Oh, there it goes. That's wood over there. We okay. need another one here, right, do we? Right, we do. Okay, so, here we go. I'm just gonna drill another hole in there, and another one in there, so we can put it back, so we can put the curtains up soon. Up soon? Very soon. Very soon. All right, so I just put a marker in there, like that. It's too rough for us, I guess. I'm gonna drill it, yeah. Here we go. <laughs> 
Okay, there you go. That's one. Go drill the other one. Okay. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Huh? Okay. Muffin, we help? Muffin, help? You are helping already, buddy. Okay, hold this for me, please. Hold this, hold this for me. Hold this. Thank you for helping. Mm -hmm. Okay, so guys, here we go. So here's an example in here. Apparently the wood wasn't strong enough or we didn't catch enough wood. So out here we're going to have to pull all this wire, this, cable, this screws out, and we're going to have to use the anchor to get in there. We may have to cut the anchor just to fit in there, but we're going to do it again, okay guys? Okay, alright guys. So I'm just going to make the hole a little bigger so the anchor will in. I think I'm using way too much tape on this drill. It's easy adjustable. And you guys know how to do that. I'm assuming, I'm hoping. And hoping this. If you guys are wondering how to take out an anchor that's stuck in there. Here's one tip for you. Put a screw in there. Get one of these or strong enough with your hands. And just pull it up. Hey buddy, wait up, wait up. Wait. So, if you're wondering about the kid and noise, we purposely decided to have this recorded so that it's a little bit more realistic when you do a DIY project at home with kids around. Technically speaking, for safety reasons, you don't really have kids around because they get in the way or they could possibly get hurt while in the process. But in this case, we know what we're doing and it's just as simple as doing this. Not a lot of heavy machineries. I try to get it involved with it. But now he's going to try because he wants to play with the camera. But, uh, all right, everybody, let's see the little guy, the little guy that's crying. Maybe not. There we go. Okay, Mola. <laughs>